safe. Although today marks the start to the rest of our lives, I know it will not be enough time with you. I will not take our time together for granted. And because words cannot do it, I promise to show you for the rest of my life how much I love you. Leave all your worries at the door. Oh, you don't need them oh, anymore. I've got you now. <laughs> <laughs> I promise you that you'll never have to face the world alone. I promise to be there to catch you if you should stumble, carry you over every threshold, and fall in love with you every day. I promise to be the man that you inspired me to be and the man that you deserve. I promise to encourage to follow your dreams and help you to reach them. I promise to love you loyally and genuinely as long as I shall live. Your love gives me hope. Your smile gives me joy. You make me a better man. Saif, you're everything that I've ever dreamed of and everything that I will ever need. I love you. You've always said you wish I knew All of the things that hold you down When I said I do But darling, it wouldn't change a thing you are the only one that I can never lose. Oh. My sweetest pal, I have loved you for exactly 1,385 days. In all of those days, you have showed me what it is like to feel home and supported in love. Today is a still moment, suspended in time, where I am yours and you are mine. My vows to you are not just promises, they're privileges. I get to laugh with you, cry with you. I get to build a future and a family with you. Today, just like the days behind us and in all of the days in front of us, I promise to love, honor, and protect you without condition. I vow to celebrate your triumphs and nurture your goals and dreams. I vow to treat you with loyalty, compassion, and respect. You are the moon to my life until the sun rises in the west and sets in the east. As long as my heart beats, it beats for you. And as long as I breathe, you will never walk alone. Paul and Zayf, we are here to celebrate the power of your love. Today ends the preface of the book. Tomorrow, the book actually begins. You're going into what I would call a wonderful unknown. In a few minutes, your lives will officially become one. And despite what you may have learned trapped in a tiny apartment through two years of a pandemic, you will continue to learn far more and will continue to make things more and more interesting with every day that passes. The two flames are now one, as you have now formed an irreparable bond and remember that your light burns brightest together. Family and friends, by the power vested in me by the state of New York and the Universal Life Church, I now pronounce Paolo and Saif to be husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to this beautiful venue to celebrate the marriage of Saif and Paolo. Today, your friends and family surround you with love as you begin something new. There are no words to express how thankful I am to you, Saif, for making my son so complete. Paolo? I mean Pete. Polly? Wait, is it Bob? <laughs> Since you entered Saif's life, we've watched an incredible love story unfold and can't wait to see what the future brings. We would like to officially welcome you to our family. All hail King and Queen Smellion. So now to the fun part. 
I remember the day when Paolo was born 32 years ago. Don't worry, I won't go through every year. As he was growing up from a little boy playing baseball to a young man getting a college degree. Now, skipping ahead a couple decades, dozens of manhunt games on Summerland Lane, thousands of hours of video games. Still playing computer games, Molly. <laughs> and hundreds of dating app swipes. We get to the reason we're all here today. Say you. You've become an amazing, beautiful, intelligent, ambitious, inspiring woman. Your next transformation to being Paolo's wife is your next chapter that you will slay.